This week we're going back to our roots. Just two boys and one water jet. And a Craig. And a man. <laughs> <laughs> We've got another uh, eBay find. You remember that old commercial where it was the it's on eBay and it was like the bling bling gold bring or something like that? Phones that ring, organize a thing, jazz or swing, nice bling bling. It's on eBay. Just a disclaimer, this video is not sponsored by eBay, but how many things have we bought off eBay? Several. I'll we, make a playlist. we should be sponsored by eBay. I'll make a playlist, put in the description, and you can see all the things we bought on eBay. What have you brought us today? Everyone already knows because they saw the title and thumbnail. But for you, Dan, it's a starfish. No! This is Patrick! Oh. This thing is like super pokey. It weighs about half an ounce. Completely I'd say, dry. I'd say four ounces. Four ounces. Is it real? Did we get gypped or? No, that's real. Do you know what species it is? Uh, it's a starfish, Dan. <laughs> So what is the anatomy of a starfish? Where did you lick it? I licked it right in the middle. What I'm, I'm now not sure if I licked its mouth or its other end. <laughs> I think that's the same thing on a starfish. I mean, that's really weird anatomy. <laughs> Somebody knows, tell me. <laughs> tell me what I actually licked. We've got arms. Are these spikes like fingers? We'll say those are the fingers. It has approximately 700 fingers on it. Are these also fingers then? Yeah, I think it's just covered in fingers. That's about all you can see from the outside, so we're gonna have to cut it open and then we'll have you explain the inside anatomy too. Okay, stay tuned. Dude, look at all that starfish blood. That's all of its blood. And then this is all of its... It made the watery bubbly. Did you buy a carbonated starfish? I, I did, it was cheaper. I think I'm prepared for the smells oh. that might come out of this. It looked grosser than I even thought. Oh boy. Oh, it's brains are in there. Uh, where's the brain at? Can you point to it? Just that, that little flappy piece. <laughs> it's not crunchy inside. It's squishier. Oh, it's squishier because we got it wet. See, the fingers actually reach into the inside. Are those bones? Um, do, do starfish have bones? It looks bony. We're really underprepared for this video. Um, I might go with a scientific word I've heard before. Exoskeleton. <laughs> <laughs> Can you control its arm? I'm pinky deep in there. If it weren't so rigid, I'd be able to control its arm with this. You could puppeteer that that starfish? I'm confident. It mostly looks like hollow space, although I'm sure when it was alive... Do I just break it in half, That Dan? was filled with stuff. I don't know, what more would we see? Are we allowed to break things on the water jet channel? It's really pokey and hard. Just work through the pain. It's like a natural crevice in there. Is that its mouth? No, that's its armpit. That's where you licked. Yeah, where did you lick? What? In the center, okay? Well, what organs are there? That was by its brain. <laughs> you, so you licked its brain hole? Well, it's <laughs> exoskeleton brain. It's too pokey to break. It hurts my fingers. It's like bendy now. It's rehydrating with water. What smells worse, this or the tarantula? We could go get it, but I'm pretty sure the spiders was worse. Oh, I'm starting to get a whiff of that now. That's bad. Okay, so the smell is starting to come back and it's slowly starting to get a little more uh, flaccid. Is that the word you would use? Uh, I was going to say fragrant. <laughs> We're going to find out if we can rehydrate this by soaking it in water. For like 24 hours? Or even just a few minutes. Paint can full of water. Rusty paint can. Top, top that off. Once you got that, then just let it bake for a good 10 minutes. A few moments later. And it is... It's squishier. Still, Does it still poke and hurt? Still pretty pokey. Oh, I just broke another finger off. It's substantially stinkier. A little oceany. A little oceany? I think the ocean smell you're smelling might actually just be starfish. 
Starfish is what makes the ocean smell the way that it smells. Yep, meth busted. So, 10 minutes was not enough. Next step is we're jumping all the way up to 24 hours. So while we wait for 24 hours to pass, right now we are trying a new thing where we always have a giveaway going. If you go to waterjetchannel.com slash giveaway, that'll take you to our most current giveaway. As soon as that one ends, we're gonna have a new one up. We wanna just always be having a giveaway going, something that you guys can win. Uh, go ahead and check that out and keep checking back and maybe you can win some sweet stuff. Okay, next step is to sleep for 24 hours straight and then open the can. Yeah, I'll let you know how that goes. One eternity later. Dear Diary, this is video log one. Uh, it's been about 36 hours since we put this in the can. All right, there it is. The can has been sitting out in the sun all day. Oh, it stinks. So, uh, on the inside part where I determined to be its brain, it has gotten much squishier. The outside has got some good flex to it. Ugh. I don't know how soft it's supposed to get, but I feel like this is as rehydrated as it'll be. It's got some some good flex, nice and pokey on the outside still, and uh, that's what happens when you cut a starfish in half and stick it in a can in the sun for 36 hours.